McLovin didn't like the game itself. He said that it, it was so, bad. I, I, look, people, I, I'm not going to sugarcoat it. We didn't like it either. Being at the, calling the game with Marv and uh, C. Webb, we kept saying to ourselves, "Okay, well, eventually they're going to start playing here, right?" We kept looking at it like, <laughs> "Okay, second quarter, they're they're going to start like playing a little bit of D," and they never did. So people, we apologized because it was we had to search deep for stories. But it was a bad, bad game. And look, I, I understand it's an exhibition game, and I have no problems with that because these guys go at it during the regular season, and it's a chance for them to kind of relax and just put on a show for the fans. But being in the arena, it was – people were just sitting on their hands. I mean, the dunks were nice and some of the moves were nice, but the competition just wasn't there. Can you make an incentive for the winner? Is well, there you something already do. you can do? <laughs> yeah, you, you pay the winners. The winners get 50, the loser gets 35. If that's not incentive enough, I don't know what else is. Is that enough to play defense, it? Reg? <laughs> I, I, I mean – I would play defense for fifty thousand. I would play defense for thirty five thousand. I, I don't know how what, what you do to get these guys to play, um, other than look. In years past, it was your best players that kind of went after one another. And if you remember, you know Kobe and LeBron used to go at it. Uh, Kobe and Wade used to go at it, and that used to get everyone else involved. This game took on a different tone because it was the last farewell for Kobe. And I don't think he had that left in him to be that alpha dog to go after everyone else. If you, you know what I mean? Yeah. He, he, he just yeah. wanted to enjoy the moment because everyone was there really to say goodbye to him. And I think that kind of just put everyone on that relaxed mode that, okay, this is what we're here for, as opposed to, oh, we're the best 24 players on the planet. Let's go after this. Yeah, I felt bad for some of those guys who don't normally play that way, but that was what the game kind of devolved into. There were certain guys that you're just going to go, like DeMarcus Cousins is going, you know, I'm going to play 11 minutes here. There, there seemed like there was eight eight or nine guys who they just appreciate that style and had fun with it. The other guys were like, what am I doing? Like Kawhi Leonard might be the best player in the NBA all around, but it's not like that's his style. It is not his game. Yeah. You know, and that's not – not only is it not his style, but if you know his demeanor, when guys are just letting guys go around, I mean, he doesn't play that way. <laughs> he, he likes to lock you up and get into you. And to be passive at the defensive end, it's you know, almost tricking his brain a little bit. 